In recent years, the world has witnessed a significant shift away from conventional energy resources towards cleaner and more sustainable alternatives. This transition has been driven by growing concerns over climate change, air pollution, and the finite nature of fossil fuels, as countries strive to reduce their carbon footprints and meet ambitious renewable energy targets. They are exploring innovative solutions, the most stunning of which is China's artificial sun. China's artificial sun, officially known as the Experimental Advanced Superconducting Tokamak EAST, represents a remarkable achievement in the field of nuclear fusion. In this video, we are going to tell you all you need to know about this incredible technology. What is the artificial sun? Experimental Advanced Superconducting Tokamak, or EAST, is a research facility located at the Institute of Plasma Physics in Hafei, China. It's a tokamak reactor designed to study and replicate the conditions necessary for nuclear fusion, the same process that powers the sun. The EAST project aims to achieve controlled fusion reactions by creating and confining a plasma state at extremely high temperatures. The tokamak design consists of a toroidal, donut-shaped chamber, where a high-temperature plasma of hydrogen isotopes is contained and heated using powerful magnetic fields. EAST, or EAST, utilizes advanced superconducting technologies to maintain the high magnetic fields required for plasma confinement. Superconductors are materials that can conduct electricity with zero electrical resistance when cooled to very low temperatures. This allows for efficient and sustained plasma confinement, enabling researchers to study the behavior of the plasma and advance fusion research. Since its inception, the EAST project has made significant progress in the field of nuclear fusion. It has achieved remarkable temperatures of over 100 million degrees Celsius, which is several times hotter than the core of the sun. This extreme heat is necessary to overcome the repulsive forces between atomic nuclei, allowing them to fuse and release large amounts of energy. What is nuclear fusion and how does it work? Nuclear fusion is a process that occurs when atomic nuclei come together to form a heavier nucleus, releasing an enormous amount of energy in the process. It is the fundamental process that powers the sun and other stars in the universe. In contrast to nuclear fission, which involves splitting heavy atomic nuclei, fusion combines light atomic nuclei to create heavier ones. It is considered the holy grail of energy production, as it offers immense potential with virtually limitless fuel, zero greenhouse gas emissions, and minimal radioactive waste. The basic principle behind nuclear fusion is that atomic nuclei carry a positive electric charge, and they repel each other due to electromagnetic forces. Overcoming this repulsion requires extremely high temperatures and pressures to bring the nuclei close enough for the strong nuclear force which is attractive to take effect. When this happens, the atomic nuclei can merge, forming a new nucleus and releasing a tremendous amount of energy in the form of light and heat. The primary fuel for nuclear fusion is isotopes of hydrogen, particularly deuterium and tritium. Deuterium is a naturally occurring isotope of hydrogen, while tritium is radioactive and can be produced by irradiating lithium in a nuclear reactor. These isotopes are chosen because they are abundant and relatively easy to obtain. To initiate and sustain a fusion reaction, scientists employ various devices, the most common of which is the tokamak. A tokamak consists of a donut-shaped vacuum chamber in which a plasma of hydrogen isotopes is confined and heated to extremely high temperatures using magnetic fields. The magnetic fields prevent the plasma from coming into contact with the chamber walls and cooling down, allowing it to reach temperatures of millions of degrees Celsius. Why is China making the artificial sun? There are several reasons behind China's artificial sun. We are going to go through them one by one to get a complete picture of such a massive project. Energy Security China's emphasis on energy security stems from its recognition as the world's largest energy consumer. With a rapidly growing economy and population, China faces the challenge of meeting its energy demands sustainably. By investing in fusion energy research, China aims to reduce its reliance on conventional energy resources that are limited, subject to price volatility, and vulnerable to geopolitical tensions. Fusion energy's potential for near-limitless and sustainable power generation aligns with China's goal of ensuring a stable and secure energy supply. Climate Change Mitigation 
China is actively addressing the urgent issue of climate change as a significant contributor to global greenhouse gas emissions. The country has committed to ambitious targets to reduce its carbon footprint and transition to a low-carbon economy. Fusion energy as a carbon-free energy source has the potential to play a crucial role in mitigating climate change. By investing in the artificial sun, China aims to support the development of fusion energy technology as a means to combat climate change and fulfill its environmental commitments. Technological Leadership China's investment in the Artificial Sun Project reflects its aspiration to become a global leader in science, technology, and innovation. By pushing the boundaries of fusion energy technology, China aims to demonstrate its scientific prowess and showcase its commitment to cutting-edge research. The Artificial Sun serves as a symbol of China's technological capabilities signaling its ambition to be at the forefront of the clean energy revolution. By positioning itself as a leader in fusion energy, China seeks to stimulate economic growth, attract investment in advanced technologies, and foster a culture of innovation. International Collaboration China recognizes that nuclear fusion research requires collaboration and knowledge sharing on a global scale. By participating in international fusion research collaborations such as the ITER project, China actively engages with scientists and researchers worldwide. This cooperative approach allows China to contribute its expertise, share resources, and leverage the collective efforts of the global fusion community. Collaborative research and knowledge exchange accelerate the development of fusion energy technology and facilitate progress toward practical fusion power generation. Future Energy Market Potential the successful commercialization of fusion energy could have transformative effects on the global energy market. By taking a leading role in the development of the artificial sun, China positions itself to gain a competitive advantage in the emerging fusion energy industry. As a pioneer in fusion technology, China could be at the forefront of technological exports, creating new markets, generating employment opportunities, and fostering economic growth. Furthermore, China's influence in the energy sector would be enhanced, solidifying its position as a key player in shaping the future of global energy systems. How did China launch an artificial sun? The Experimental Advanced Superconducting Tokamak EAST, achieved a steady-state, high-confinement, long plasma operation for 403 seconds in April this year, a key step toward the development of a fusion reactor. The breakthrough achieved after more than 120,000 shots, greatly improved the original world record of 101 seconds, which was set by EAST in 2017. It will provide an important experimental basis for the operation of the International Thermonuclear Experimental Reactor and the country's independent construction and operation of fusion reactors. The ultimate goal of EAST, located at the Institute of Plasma Physics under the Chinese Academy of Sciences, or ASIPP, in Hefei, is to create nuclear fusion like the sun, using substances abundant in the sea to provide a steady stream of clean energy. Song Yuntao, ASIPP director, told Xinhua in an exclusive interview that the main significance of this breakthrough lies in the high confinement mode. The temperature and density of particles have been greatly increased during high confinement plasma operation, which will lay a solid foundation for improving the power generation efficiency of future fusion power plants. And reducing costs, he said. Unlike fossil fuels such as coal, oil, and natural gas, which are in limited supply and have a great environmental impact, the artificial sun requires raw materials that are almost unlimited on Earth. Fusion energy is considered safer and cleaner, therefore the ideal ultimate energy for the future of humanity. Since its operation in 2006, the homegrown EAST has been an open test platform for Chinese and international scientists to conduct fusion-related experiments and research. The challenges faced to achieve sustainable nuclear fusion. Achieving nuclear fusion, the process that powers the sun and the artificial sun and holds immense promise for clean and abundant energy on Earth, presents several significant challenges. Despite the potential benefits, scientists and engineers face numerous obstacles in realizing practical fusion power. The most important challenges to achieve nuclear fusion and hence create an artificial sun are high temperature and pressure. Fusion reactions require incredibly high temperatures and pressures to overcome the repulsive forces between atomic nuclei. In practical terms, this means creating and maintaining a plasma, a state of matter consisting of hot charged particles at temperatures exceeding millions of degrees Celsius. 
Achieving and controlling such extreme conditions is a formidable challenge that demands innovative technologies and materials capable of withstanding intense heat and pressure. Plasma Instabilities and Confinement Maintaining a stable and confined plasma is crucial for achieving sustained fusion reactions. However, plasma tends to be inherently unstable, subject to turbulence, instabilities, and disruptions that can disrupt the fusion process. Controlling and confining the plasma over extended periods is a significant technical challenge. Scientists are continuously developing advanced plasma control techniques and magnetic confinement systems, such as tokamax and Stellarators, to overcome these instabilities and improve plasma confinement. Energy Balance and Efficiency one of the critical challenges in fusion research is achieving net energy gain, where the energy output from fusion reactions exceeds the energy input required to sustain the fusion process. Currently, most fusion experiments require more energy to maintain the plasma than they produce from fusion reactions. Achieving a sustained, self-sustaining fusion reaction that generates a surplus of energy is a major milestone that researchers are striving to reach. It requires optimizing the energy balance, minimizing energy losses, and maximizing fusion reaction rates. Materials and Engineering The extreme conditions within a fusion reactor place immense strain on materials. The intense heat, radiation, and high energy particles degrade and erode materials over time, limiting the lifespan and efficiency of fusion reactors. Developing materials that can withstand prolonged exposure to high temperatures and radiation while maintaining structural integrity is a critical challenge. Additionally, efficient cooling systems, advanced manufacturing techniques, and innovative engineering solutions are necessary to construct and maintain fusion reactors. Economics and Scalability Fusion power has the potential to provide clean, sustainable, and virtually limitless energy. However, realizing fusion on a commercial scale requires overcoming significant economic challenges. The construction and operation of fusion reactors are highly capital-intensive. Developing cost-effective fusion technologies, improving efficiency, and reducing the size and complexity of fusion systems are critical for making fusion power economically viable and scalable. Regulatory and Safety Concerns as with any advanced technology, the development of fusion power must address regulatory and safety considerations. Fusion reactions produce high-energy neutrons that can damage reactor components and induce radioactivity. Ensuring safe operation, managing and disposing of radioactive waste, and implementing robust safety protocols are paramount. Additionally, regulatory frameworks and international cooperation are necessary to establish standards, guidelines, and protocols for the safe deployment and operation of fusion reactors. It's not actually a sun. Contrary to misconceptions fueled by sensationalized videos and false information on social media, the experimental advanced superconducting tokamak East is not a floating sphere of light or a celestial object launched into the sky. It is, in fact, a donut-shaped reactor chamber designed to facilitate controlled nuclear fusion experiments. Inside the East reactor chamber, a superheated plasma consisting of charged particles is trapped and confined using powerful magnetic fields. The primary objective of EAST is not to emit light or heat like the sun, but rather to generate a substantial amount of clean energy that researchers hope to harness for powering cities and meeting the growing energy demands of society. The moniker Artificial Sun is attributed to EAST because the process of nuclear fusion conducted within the facility emulates the physical principles responsible for the sun's energy generation. The comparison to the sun's physics highlights the immense potential of nuclear fusion as an energy source. By replicating the conditions of the sun within the EAST reactor, scientists aim to unlock the secrets of fusion energy and develop the necessary technologies to harness this clean and virtually limitless power source. It has broken all the records. Prior to the development of the experimental advanced superconducting tokamak East, the Tor Supra tokamak in France held the world record for the longest duration of a plasma state in a tokamak reactor. In 2003, Tor Supra achieved a remarkable plasma duration of 6.5 minutes, demonstrating the feasibility of maintaining a stable plasma for an extended period. Following Tor Supra's achievement, South Korea's Korea Superconducting Tokamak Advanced Research KSTAR reactor made significant progress in 2016 by setting a new world record. K-STAR successfully sustained a plasma temperature of 50 million degrees Celsius, 90 million degrees Fahrenheit for a duration of 70 seconds. 
This achievement showcased the growing advancements in fusion research and brought scientists closer to realizing the potential of fusion energy. However, the EAST project in China took a significant leap forward by surpassing K-STAR's record. EAST achieved a remarkable plasma temperature of around 119 million degrees Celsius, or 216 million degrees Fahrenheit, and sustained this temperature for an impressive duration of 102 seconds. This breakthrough demonstrated the remarkable progress made in controlling and confining high-temperature plasmas, bringing researchers closer to the goal of practical fusion energy. Building upon its previous achievements, EAST has recently broken its own record once again. In a remarkable feat, the EAST reactor sustained a nuclear fusion reaction for an astonishing duration of 403 seconds. This groundbreaking achievement marks a significant milestone in fusion research, showcasing the growing capabilities of fusion reactors to achieve prolonged plasma stability and sustain the conditions necessary for nuclear fusion to occur. How is the artificial sun expanding clean energy options? China's artificial sun is playing a transformative role in shifting the world away from conventional energy sources towards clean and sustainable alternatives. One of the most pressing global challenges is reducing greenhouse gas emissions to mitigate climate change. Conventional energy sources are significant contributors to carbon dioxide emissions. Fusion energy, as pursued through the artificial sun, does not emit carbon dioxide or other greenhouse gases during operation. By advancing fusion technology, China is helping to shift the world towards a low-carbon future by providing a clean energy alternative that can significantly reduce carbon emissions and combat climate change. Many countries heavily rely on fossil fuels for their energy needs, which poses several challenges such as price volatility and geopolitical risks. The Artificial Sun Project offers an opportunity to diversify the global energy mix. Fusion energy can provide a stable, secure, and self-sufficient source of power. By investing in fusion research, China is driving the development of a clean and abundant energy source that can reduce dependence on conventional energy resources, enhancing global energy security, and reducing geopolitical tensions associated with energy access. The Race for Unlimited Energy China has invested over $1 trillion in the development of EAST, which serves as a testing ground for technologies that will be utilized in the International Thermonuclear Experimental Reactor ITER, project. ITER, a collaborative effort involving 35 countries including major nations like China, the United States, India, and European Union member states, aims to construct the largest nuclear fusion reactors in the world. Live Science has reported that ITER will incorporate the most powerful magnet ever built, capable of generating a magnetic field 280,000 times stronger than the Earth's. The fusion reactor is anticipated to commence operations in 2025, providing scientists with the invaluable insights into practical implementation of fusion power. China is not solely relying on ITER for fusion energy research, but is also actively pursuing its own programs. In addition to the EAST project, China is conducting experiments in inertial confinement fusion and has plans to complete a new tokamak reactor by the early 2030s. These initiatives demonstrate China's commitment to advancing fusion technology and its aspiration to be at the forefront of the global fusion energy industry. Meanwhile, in the United States, significant progress is being made toward the development of a viable fusion reactor. It is projected that the first operational fusion reactor in the United States could be completed as early as 2025. Additionally, a British company is aiming to achieve commercial electricity generation from fusion power by 2030. These efforts indicate the increasing momentum and global interest in realizing the potential of fusion energy as a reliable and sustainable source of power. Thank you for watching this video. We hope you liked it. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel. We also appreciate your feedback, so don't hesitate to express your thoughts and opinions in the comments section. We'll be back with another amazing video soon. Peace out.